Just few hours to go now. In fact, precisely 24 hours for the Ram Temple to open its doors and for the Pran Pratishta ceremony. And now exclusive details of the Mandir event on India Today. What is likely to happen on 22nd January, which is Monday morning? There is going to be a majestic Mangal Dhwani that will start to play from about 10 a.m. And uh, I'm, I'm telling you now the details of precisely what is expected. So there is going to be a Mangal Dhwani and the air will resonate with that sound. Unique instruments that have been brought in from various states, uh, they will unite in this divine orchestration. It will be uh, according to as posted also by the uh, Thieves Trust. This will be an opportunity to embrace and revive the age-old traditions of Bharat. Very interesting choice of words there. That uh, on the sacred day of Sri Ram Lalla's Pran Pratishta, there will be Mangal Dhwani celebration in the air. Unique instruments from various trades uh, will unite in divine orchestration. It will be an opportunity to embrace and revive the age-old traditions. And which states are we talking about? Uttar Pradesh, Karnataka, Punjab, Maharashtra, Odisha, Madhya Pradesh, Manipur, Assam, Chhattisgarh, Delhi, Rajasthan, Bengal, Andhra Pradesh, Jharkhand, Gujarat, Bihar, Uttarakhand, Tamil Nadu. This connects north, south, east, west of the country. And there is going to be a Mangal Dhwani with regard to 50 instruments. Samarth Srivastav is joining me this morning for the latest on that. Samarth, it's absolutely incredible that there is going to be an orchestration by a musician, a senior musician from Ayodhya itself and the rendition will be by the Sangeet Natak Academy. You take us through the details that there is going to be not just music, but music like and bhajans and, and divine music that we've never heard like before. It will be the Mangal Dhwani celebration and it's a very unique style in respect of uh, Pran Pratishtha event of Lord Sri Ram and that will be not just limited to UP, musical in instruments from like flute, dholak will, be, will come from UP while from many other states including MP, Assam, uh, West Bengal, many other uh, states all musical instruments will be coming here and around 10 a.m. on the day of uh, Pran Pratishtha that means tomorrow this event will start happening. This is being done by Yatendra Mishra and another Sangeet Nata Academy of Delhi. So both of them are doing this particular event. We have heard in the Vedic sculptures that these instruments played a crucial role whenever some positive vibes were there, whenever Yagya Havan happened in the Treta Yug. And now they want to take us to that particular scenario. They want to make us feel, the, give the same feel what could have happened during that time when the main temple was erected in the Treta Yuga and they want to make this particular scene and that's why this update has come from Sri Ram Janam Bhumi Chetra where this musical thing will be happening and this will be for the devotion of Lord Sri Ram. This is very interesting and I'm quoting from what uh, the Sri Ram Tarth Tathirstriya Trust has said that at 10 a.m. there is going to be a Mangal Dhwani witness over 50 exquisite instruments from different states. They'll resonate for nearly two hours. That is just before the Pran Pratishta ceremony will begin by the Yajman. And this will be orchestrated by Ayodhya's own Yatindra Mishra, a grand musical rendition supported by the Sangeet Nat Natak Academy in Delhi. And this will be to go back to how it would have been possibly many centuries ago in Bharat. Samar, stay on with me. We have more news coming in about what is happening in Ayodhya where Samarth has been reporting for days now.